channel it's your girl Maya, also known as soul style beauty and today it's a brand new video so today we're going to be talking about combating negative thinking and also doubt okay so this is a soul flexion video and what i'm planning to do is drop these every single monday because when you go into a fresh week you want new intentions you want a fresh mindset you want to make sure that you're going in and you're ready for the week you know especially if you're a teacher like me because your mindset is literally everything and it can just, you'll just have an even faster burnout. But anyways, I hope that everyone's well. I hope that you had a beautiful Thanksgiving, whether it was solo or with family. For me, it was just like really, really chill. Like it was just me, Jose, and my parents. That's it. And I was just satisfied with that. Especially being like the first year where both my parents was in the same, you know, home. So it really meant a lot for me. So it was like a sentimental Thanksgiving. But I hope that you guys enjoy. If you do enjoy this video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you're not a part of the Soul Style Beauty family. Don't forget to follow on social media, on Instagram, at Soul Style Beauty. If I'm not on here, I can guarantee I am on Instagram. So definitely follow me over there. And let's get into the video. Honestly, when it comes to your mindset, it's everything. It will either make or break you. And it definitely affects the way that you show up in the world. And it also affects like how you move. So if I don't believe, and it's a root of like unbelief or doubt in myself, in my in God, in the dreams and, and my capabilities, you're not gonna show up like you actually believe. You're not gonna put your all into it. And this is why I say like your mindset is so important. I have to do things on a daily to protect my mindset because it is that serious. One thing that I've been doing daily is like thinking about some practical ways of how I can like combat negative thinking on a daily because sometimes it just comes out of nowhere literally it can be like me scrolling through Instagram and then I watch something on TV maybe like you're getting tons of information daily um so we're going to talk about a few things that I like to do practical ways of how I combat doubt how I combat um negative thinking and let's get into the first. Let's talk about identity because I'm telling you, identity is everything. What you think about yourself, what God thinks about you. If you don't believe in that, then we need to get to the root. When it comes down to identity in a biblical perspective, I feel like you know as a believer that Christ lives inside of you. Whenever you accepted God, when you got saved, you know that, that the Holy Spirit lives inside of you. Knowing the, the role of the Holy Spirit who lives inside of you, that's an indicator that my faith is low. That's an indicator that I'm far away from God. Maybe I'm not in my word. Maybe I don't have faith. Uh, maybe I, I have not been like leaving room for God. So I always discuss things with myself at a biblical level. Then I also like to look at myself. Like what do I think about myself as well? Um, because I think that is super important because when you pursue certain things, you have to do it without the accolades, without the support, without the applause, you have to know that you're bringing something to the table. There are times where I go to certain events, like when it comes to influencing and in the beauty world. And when I first started out, I was very insecure on what I did. And I'm like, I like, why would these people want to communicate with me? Why would they want to connect? And even sometimes still, I can still feel that way. But I think that's why it's good from time to time to make a list about what are the things that you like about yourself. Because if you know your strong suit, you know that you're showing up and you have something to offer. So start with identity. So number two, you wanna definitely write down your triggers. So like I said, like it will, sometimes doubt comes out of nowhere. Sometimes you being like insecure or like having negative thoughts comes out of nowhere. So what happened? Like were you scrolling through your phone? Were you watching a specific TV show? What was it? And let's do less of that. Not more, but less. Then you would have to also ask yourself like why, right? Because like we have human emotions too. So if I'm looking at somebody's Instagram and I'm like, oh, I was triggered because I was looking at them and they have like a big house and they have this, like that's me just being jealous. So you have to know if it's you or is it really like what's triggering you? And that's why you write it down and that's why you analyze it. Third thing, pray. Yes, girl, pray. <laughs> so. I remember when I used to be, be like, oh, it's a scam. Like, prayer is a scam. And I want to do a whole different video on that. But it was just like, you know, certain things weren't working. 
but then things were working but not as fast as I wanted them to happen and also the outcome that I expected to receive or be answered that prayer didn't line up so I was like what's going on God like what is this I'm telling you prayer works and also the word says pray without ceasing pray in all circumstances so definitely don't think that prayer is like a scam or it's like some cliche thing like really believe he's not a guy that you know prayers fall on deaf ears so make sure that you are truly believing when you pray lastly speak over yourself affirmations 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 like speaking over yourself like writing things that you know are specific to those negative thoughts or those specific doubts and speaking that over your life every day it helps it helps it helps so definitely um look up biblical affirmations like from scripture and you can also write your own affirmations and speak that over your life i'm a believer of both trust if you made it to the end you are a gem if anything resonated with you make sure to leave a comment down below also make sure to share this video if it truly truly helped you and also don't forget to follow me on soul sound beauty on instagram because if i'm not here i'm also on instagram so once again thank you so so much for being subscribed and i'll see you next time Bye.